Welcome to my throw again, and uh, we've done Max Hop, and now it's a pleasure to meet the big Austrian. We're going to call him the Flying Austrian, Mensa Sulevich. Thanks for doing this, Mensa. It's an absolute pleasure now. As everyone knows, you dart fans, Mensa's got a unique throw. Nothing like anybody else's. We're just going to have a look at his darts. Let's have a look at the darts, Mensa. Just a, a basic straight barrel. Different shaped flight to say Max Hop and a lot of the other players, but that's all down to the, the flight in the air and what suits you. Uh, a nice clean point, there's no real knurls on that point. Right, now we're going to have a look at this grip, and this is unique. Can you hold the dart how you do to okay. throw it? Just, uh, just play so. Have this a look at that. Have a look at that. Correct. That is unique. Yeah. And then put your hand over it. Yes, yeah. what I'm feeling here. You're feeling it's, there? It's very, very small, but I'm not tasting, no grip. Now, no that's unique because most of the darts huh? are on here. Now, he used Correct. to throw with the dart in his fingertips, but he got dartitis. And this is the way Come he's on. got over dartitis. And he's the only player that I know that's got over dartitis and plays at the standard that he does. Most people have got this dart up here. Mensa has it here, and that's because of this grip. He's got the whole hand round there, and that's where he feels comfortable. And you can see him just twitching on the old fingers to get it comfortable. Yeah. yeah, he's just trying to get this Still thumb easier. on right. the end of that, that dart, yeah. and when it's in the right place, then it's set. See that, he's just turning that flight in his hand. Look at that twist of the flight, until he finds it comfortable in his hand. Then it's pull it back and release it. That's just something that he, in his head he gets comfortable with. And when he feels it's right, then it's set and pulled back. Not many people do that. Some players pull it back, twiddle it in here and then throw it. But Mintz gets it there and then it's on its way. Now let's have a look at his arm. If you just set the position, it's a little bit lower than, say, a Max Hop, which was up here. But if you can throw with me holding it here, go and throw Mintz. He's not, losing his, he's not losing his height on the elbow. That's the main thing. The elbow is keeping up. And again, that's so essential in a good throw that he keeps the elbow up. So although he's got these idiosyncrasies, we call them, the fundamentals of a solid throw is there. Now, if we come around here and see your throw, and we'll see this back leg. See, that's a good stance, body, Top all over that foot, right throw. That's a good one, he hasn't moved. Normally happens with the last dart. There we go. He kind of walks a little bit with that dart, but the dart's already released. Sometimes he really does kick up, but this guy is one of the best players in the world with James Wade at hitting doubles, punishing opponents is an expert at. Another thing about Mensa's throw is when he pulls it back into what we call the block position, it comes in here. It doesn't come under his eye, he has not got a short back lift, he's got a, quite a long back lift. Have a look at this. Just gonna look at his stance. Look at that, another straight line. Balanced, although he leans forward on the set position, totally balanced. Got his heel on the floor, he's not on his toes until sometimes he does that, but it's normally with the, with the last dart, and 180. Not a bad way to finish. Well, Mintz, thank you very much for that. I much appreciate it. And he's actually playing tonight. 